ancient Greek philosopher Plato and modern proponents of the art of manifestation appear on the surface to inhabit divergent realms of thought. Plato's thought theory of forms posits a world of unchanging, non-material forms or ideals that represent the most accurate reality. The art of manifestation, on the other hand, emphasizes the individual's ability to bring desires into physical existence through focused intention and belief. Yet on a deeper exploration level is revealed an intriguing confluence where these two seemingly disparate concepts merge, revealing insights into the nature of reality, desire, and human potential. Please like, comment, and most importantly, subscribe and share my videos. Plato's theory of forms contends that non-material abstract forms or ideals represents the highest and most fundamental kind of reality. These forms are unchangeable and eternal. They are perfect representations of the myriad of imperfect, changing entities we encounter in the material world. For Plato, the world we perceive through our senses is but a shadow of this higher reality, a fleeting reflection of eternal forms. In the realm of manifestation, the focus shifts from the abstract to the tangible, from the eternal to the temporal. The art of manifestation posits that through intention, belief, and alignment with the universe, individuals can bring their desires into physical reality. The manifester becomes a creator. Their thoughts and feelings serve as the chisel that shapes the marble of the universe, revealing the hidden form within. At first glance, these two philosophies seem to diverge. One elevates the non-material, while the other seeks to materialize the immaterial. However, an integrative perspective unveils a harmonious dialogue between these seemingly contrasting views. This confluence arises when we consider the forms as the ultimate ideals, the blueprints of perfection, that the art of manifestation seeks to bring into reality. Imagine the form of a tree, an entity embodying the perfect essence of treeness in Plato's higher reality. In the art of manifestation, an individual might seek to bring forth a tree in their physical environment. This tree, as a representation of the sensory world, is inherently imperfect and transient, yet it emanates from the eternal form of the tree. The manifestor, through intention and alignment, acts as a bridge between the world of forms and the sensory world, drawing the eternal and ideal closer to the tangible existence. Further, the process of manifestation is, in essence, a journey towards alignment with one's true desires and the universal energies that govern existence. This alignment resonates with Plato's notion of anamnesis, the act of remembering the knowledge of the forms that our soul has forgotten upon entering the physical body. We as individuals who practice the art of manifestation engage in a form of anamnesis, aligning our desires with the ideals of the forms and bringing them closer to the ultimate reality. Moreover, both Plato's theory of forms and the art of manifestation underscore the transformative power of the mind 
and the potential for human beings to shape their reality. For Plato, knowledge of the forms brings enlightenment and understanding of the true nature of existence. Similarly, the art of manifestation empowers individuals to create their reality consciously based on their understanding and alignment with their desires and the universe. Limited to shadows on the wall represent individuals bound by the limitations of sensory perception and unaware of their creative potential. The journey out of the cave symbolizes the path of manifestation where the individuals break free from limitations, align with the universal energies, and bring forth the light of the forms into the shadows of the physical world. In conclusion, integrating Plato's theory of forms with the art of manifestation offers a harmonious perspective on the relationship between the ideal and the tangible, between the eternal and the temporal. The forms serve as the ultimate ideals, blueprints of perfection, that the art of manifestation seeks to realize in the physical world. Through intention, belief, and alignment, individuals act as bridges between these two realms drawing forth the light of the forms into the sensory world. This confluence of ideals invites a deeper exploration of human potential, the nature of reality, and the transformative power of the mind, opening new avenues for understanding and personal growth.